Hi, I'm Nick. I drive a three-wheeler, Robin Line, 850cc, LX. I drive it because I've got a full motorbike licence. I haven't got a car licence. I got it cheaper than what it was meant to be because a mate of mine, his wife, uh, used to drive it around and just got really, really old and uh, fell ill and died. And uh, that's how I end up with a car. It's... It, it, it keeps me dry, it got, got me off the motorbike in, into the vehicle. A lot of people to take fun out of me for having it, but it, it's a lovely vehicle. The modifications scene, I started out recently, joined in with um, a few of the, the club, and it was just basically to get more friends and, and um, to do different things. I've done a lot of modifications to this car to make it go faster for looks and all sorts of things. I've got wider wheels to make it more stable. Tint out windows so people can't see the, the amount of stereo equipment I've got in here is unreal. DVD player, sub, loads of different um, lights on it and loads of LED flashing lights inside the car. And uh, it's just so much stuff that I've done to it. It's crazy because standard there, they're lovely, but it's just slow. Done a lot of work, a lot, a lot of work, and I had a lot of lot of friends help that's the whole part of being in a club is the friends the amount of help you get to mod your car is just unreal it's it's all the extra bits to that make you feel better for driving it which is at the end of the day why you do it it's, it's so you feel good driving around and people look at you which makes you feel even more better even if you, you yeah even if you ain't got no hardly any money you you you, you but on what you can. Uh, one last modification is my interior light, which technically uh, I robbed the idea from Sticks. I saw it in his car and I thought I'd, I'd mod it slightly different into mine, and it really, really works well. The reason I got into into the scene is is basically to wind my circle of friends, because when you sat around at home doing nothing every night and bored out your skull, you. You got no one to talk to, no name, and these people are amazing. They are willing to, well, give their time. There's a lot of them that will do anything for you, just because you've got a car and you're in the same scene, and you, you really, it, it moves you because these people, you wouldn't even notice. You, you drive past or walk past every day, and wouldn't give them the time of the day, and just because now you've made a slight bit of effort. It opens a whole new world. Government are trying to stop us. They're putting so many rules and regulations out there to stop us. And we're not doing no one harm. There are a few bad eggs out there, but they can't help it. They're just young and don't understand it. You, you can't blame them. And then it tarnishes the whole lot of us. A lot of people get jealous because you've got a car, because yours is a certain way. They either nick bits off your car or they scratch it. I just can't see the point. There's a few people that are purists and if your car ain't a certain way, ain't got certain mods on, they blank you. We we celebrate each other's birthdays. We, we do so much more. We have now become like family and close network of people. If anybody wanted anything or needed anything, we'd all jump. There is no if, no buts. Thank you very much for listening to us or me. Thank you very much. Are you satisfied with the response, yeah? If not, click another one.